whitish patches over the body. It's called pityriasis alba. Most of the time, that is the reason for this uh, whitish patches. It's a very uh, commonly seen uh, lesion in children and adults. Uh, uh, pityriasis alba mainly means that dry skin, white in color. Uh, basically, uh, there may be uh, mild scaling of skin over the lesion. Uh, it's a minor manifestation of atopic dermatitis eczema. Uh, it is uh, ill-defined. The edges are, uh, they just fade into the uh, rest of the surrounding. So, uh, ill-defined macules and patches and uh, sometimes initially it may be uh, slightly reddish in color and then slowly become whitish in color. Mostly seen on the face, chest, arms and uh, trunks and sometimes exposure to sunlight can increase the uh, lesions. Most of the time it resolves spontaneously but may take a uh, few months to years. Um, you just need to get reassured that it is a benign thing and uh, if it is very severe, low potent uh, topical steroids and moisturizers are used to uh, treat it. Another thing which is similar to Pityriasis alba is tinea versicolor. It is a fungal infection. Uh, it looks similar, whitish patches, circular, but it is more defined. The edges are more sharp. And again, it uh, commonly affects the trunk and shoulders and uh, most frequently seen in teen and uh, young adults. Uh, just like in uh, Pityriasis alba, this also may be aggravated by uh, sun exposure. Antifungal creams and uh, lotions are the mainstay of treatment. And even after successful treatment, the discoloration can stay for a longer time, uh, maybe few months. And it may uh, recur during uh, change in seasons, warm, humid climate where most of our climate is uh, the same way and uh, is, this can occur recurrently but it gets resolved without much sequelae. Happy parenting.